When it comes to background removers, some are better than others, especially if you have intricate designs like this. Now, if I were to run this through Canva, it wouldn't do an amazing job, but this tool just here, this background remover, if we toggle this off, we can see that this does an insanely good job. Now, the website which I want to share with you is this one just here. It's called clipdrop.co. Now, if we scroll through this, we can see that they have lots of great tools. Now, some of them are paid and some of them are free. The one that we're mainly going to check out is this background remover just here. And if we come over to the pricing, we can see that we can actually use the background removal with image sizes by 1024 by 1024, which is perfect because that's the standard mid-journey size. So let me go ahead and share with you just how easy this is to use. Now, if you want to come and check this out, I will link this down in the description as well. So to use this, all we have to do is take our image and then drop it in just here. Now, if we quickly read this, it says, we can drop up to 10 files at a time. But for this example, we're just going to do one. So I'm going to take my mid-journey clip art. I'm just going to drag it in like that. Then within a few seconds, it does its thing and removes the background, as we can see just here. Now, in my opinion, this is actually one of the best background removers, or should I say free background removers, that there is online. Now with me personally, most of the time I use Canva Pro and with Canva Pro, there's actually a background remover, but this free tool actually does a lot better job. Now, if we take a look at this, we can see the intricate details of the feathers and this background remover has no problem at all removing the background. Now what I like about this is that if we go up here to where this eye is, we can toggle the background on and off. So this is what it looked like first. We can see again a lot of intricate details, but then if we just quickly remove the background, we can see it does an insanely good job. Now I've got a few more examples that I'm quickly going to go through just so you can see this amazing tool. So I have this image just here. I created this clip art a while back. We can see again, it has some really intricate details around the flowers and around the leaves. Now again, running this through a standard background remover doesn't really do a good job. But then when we drop it into clip drop, it does an amazing job. So if we remove the background, we can see all of these intricate details, it has no problem at all removing them. Now that's the first image. I do have another one just here, these floral cats, which actually look pretty good. And again, if I were to run this through Canva, it does have issues from time to time. But again, if we run this through ClipDrop, let's toggle that off, we can see it just does an insanely good job. And again, it's completely free. So that's the second example which I wanted to show you. I just have one more just here. These are these little floral mice in cups, which look quite adorable. But with this one, I have run this through Canva before. And when it comes to the little bits like here, these little white areas around the leaves, around the flowers, it really has an issue removing them. But again, once we run this through clipdrop.com, it does an amazing job. So come through, try it out, because I think you're going to love this. Again, I'll leave this a link for this down in the description below. Now, quick tip, which I quickly want to share with you. As I said just here, the background removal, you can only use images by 1024 by 1024. So if you're creating mid-journey clip art, then you don't want to upscale the image first. What you want to do is come in, download your image. Now, this is actually a real cool free Chrome extension, which I recently made a video about. What I'll do is link that down in the description as well. It's this video just here, but this is actually one of the best free Chrome extensions for mid-journey out there. So have a watch of that because this just saves so much time. But again, what you want to do is download your image first, then you want to remove the background, 
and then once the background has been removed after that we can just go to download but after that is when you want to upscale your images so then i'll take that and then upload it upscale and do that so as we can see 1024 by 1024 is the standard dimensions for mid journey and with clip drop that's the highest dimensions or that's the highest that we can upload into the background remover so create your clip art then remove the background and then you can upscale so come through try it out there will be a link down in the description below now if you enjoyed this video and you want to watch more of my content then click right here and watch this video